You know what, you guys, so far, so good. Nothing like this day last year. We all remember the implosion of Southwest Airlines. That's not happening so far this morning anyway. I went inside to look at the departure and arrival boards. I'm here at Terminal 2. That's where Delta, Alaska Air, they're all taking off and landing. The departure and arrival boards are clear. Everybody's on time. In fact, the flights coming in from the East Coast are arriving early. So out here is the typical wave rush of travelers coming in in waves, but nobody's getting stranded. People are able to leave and take off out of here. We did speak with lots of people leaving and people who had just arrived. We met one woman who landed here from Portland, Oregon, who said it was busier this morning than when she traveled before Christmas, but no problems. A little busy, but mostly smooth. Everything was on time. We actually ended early here. We're excited that it looks like it's not as a mess as last year, so we're, we're excited. No line to check in the luggage. That's a good start. Yeah, not a mess like last year. I was, you guys, I was actually with you on the morning show, the morning after Christmas. It was an utter mess. Computers were collapsing, their whole system it's not like that now, but I will tell you online, I did read a report that Southwest Airlines in Denver, that's where the snag is. So if you have to, if you're leaving today and you have to fly through Denver or you have people coming here and they're flying from Denver, there's going to be a problem there at that airport. But otherwise here in San Diego, we're looking good. The connections seem to be good so far today, you know, at 11 o'clock, 1130 around the middle of the day. So we're going to stay out here the rest of the afternoon and just track everything, monitor things. We're going to go over to the Southwest terminal later on today and make sure things are still smooth sailing, but so far so good. Out here at San Diego International, I'm Anna Laurel for CBS.